Hello there, first grade families. This is Mrs. Salaki with an explanation of the I Spy Three Dimensional Shapes game. So let's talk first about what the attributes are of a three-dimensional shape. You might describe a three-dimensional shape by telling how many faces are on the shape, and that is the flat sides of the shape, how many edges, which is a spot where two faces meet, or how many vertices or corners, so where two or more of the faces meet. You can also describe a three-dimensional shape using its name. Here is a poster with a variety of different three-dimensional shapes that you might find around your house. If I was playing this game and this is the object I plan to describe, I would use some clues like it has two faces that are shaped like a circle. I could say my object is shaped like a cylinder and I might say that my object can roll. Another example I could use is this box. When describing the box, I would say that it has six faces. Those are the flat sides on the box. I could say that it has eight vertices and I might even talk about how it has 12 different edges. As a fun extension to this activity, you could do a 3D scavenger hunt around your house. See how many different things you can find around your house that are these different shapes. Which shapes are harder to find? Which ones are easier? Send me a picture or video of the things that you find and tell me what shapes they are.